Now you're ready to apply Interlux Epoxy Prime Code 404. It is very simple to do, and it sands to an exceptionally smooth matte finish, so it's easy to check hull fairness. Start by putting on your eye protection, gloves, the appropriate mask, and coveralls. Then stir the contents of each component. The components must be mixed in the ratio of base to curing agent by volume shown on the product label. So measure out appropriate volumes by pouring it into a separate container, a mixing pot for example. Stir thoroughly together and then leave for 20 minutes. Now you can begin to apply the primer. Start somewhere where the overlap won't be noticeable, such as on the bow or on the corner of the transom. Roller apply an even coat on one section and lightly tip off the surface vertically with a brush to remove any roller stipple. Be careful not to apply the coat too thickly so as to avoid runs and sags. Move to the next section and roller and tip off with a brush in the same way. Along the overlap, quickly work the brush horizontally over the surface to merge the layers together, then lightly tip off with the brush vertically to finish. When you have finished the first coat, clean the brush and suspend it in Interlux Brushing Thinner 2333N. Discard the roller and the roller tray liner when it's dry. Allow the first coat to dry. See the product label for details of the overcoat times. These will vary depending on the ambient temperature. Before you apply the second coat, give it a sanding with 220 grit sandpaper with a dual action or random orbital sander. This will create a better finish. You will also want to wipe off the sanding residue with Interlux Brushing Thinner 2333N. Apply the second coat in the same way as the first, rolling and tipping off with a brush. Make sure you recoat the entire area. When you have finished the job, thoroughly clean the brush in Interlux Brushing Thinner 2333N and discard the roller and roller tray liner when it's dry. Leave the second coat to dry overnight, following the guidance on the product label. Now you are ready to use your dual action or orbital sander again on the undercoat or primed surface using 220 grit sandpaper. Hand sand over the remaining areas with 220 to 320 grit sandpaper and the sanding block. Finally, dust off the hull thoroughly, giving a final wipe down using Interlux Brushing Thinner 2333N.